never knew I would be a surgeon, you know, when I grew up. But when your kids have stuffed animals that are near and dear to their heart, then you have to sew them up for them. And some of these babies have been long overdue. I feel so bad. But what can you do, you know? So I just stitched one hole. Gotta find his other one. I thought I'd take you guys along today because there's just so many things happening here. I didn't vlog yesterday. That was weird. Okay, did I is that the only hole there is on Pangui? No. No, there's another one? And one on his side. One on his side. Oh, I feel it. Okay. All right. Here he is. All right. So. Just right around, round. Right around, round. <laughs> and then. Oh, no. I even double knotted this. I wonder why it came out. You. You. Pulled it out. I did. I pulled it you out. Oh, are they all better? Penguin and Chompy, are they better? Mm -hmm. Oh, good. Now you can sleep with them again, huh? Yeah. Yeah, what do you think of him? It's an alligator, isn't it? Yeah. It's pretty cool. Show me where the girls are. They're outside. So as I was saying, I really should have vlogged yesterday because there was just so many things that happened um, all day long throughout the day. I kept thinking, oh, I should have the camera right now like to record this. It was so funny. The girls did this fun little exercise class outside like with each other, you know, and they were bouncing around and lifting weights and stair climbing and doing stuff with their hula hoops. It was the funniest thing. I wish I had like even just a little snap of it, you know, to pop in here. But I, I was sitting on the porch reading after we had done school and so I didn't get up and get the camera. <laughs> and then, um, what else? We went to the nursing home and sang for the local residents there. And that was really nice. I probably wouldn't have brought the camera there anyway, but it was a good experience. The playhouse is getting all kinds of work done on it. Ooh, sorry for the lighting there. Um, it's looking really good, so I'll have to take you out there and show you guys that. I'm just picking up dishes, you know, to fill my sink up some more because dishes are a thing around here. Are they a thing at your house too? <laughs> and then I got this great idea. Well, I had Mike bring me home a um, leaf rake because my handle for my leaf rake has slowly just sl splintered apart over the years until I pretty much, I didn't have a handle anymore. So all I had was the base to the leaf rake. I'm like, well, this isn't working too good. So I got my broom out and I was like sweeping leaves. Well, that didn't do too great either. There's a truck on or something over here. I'm seeing lights. I need to turn them off. Play trucks, play trucks. Here we go, see, Caleb's toys here. Anyway, um, he's got them all lined up to play. Uh, let's see, it had to do with the head on this guy or something. Hmm. <laughs> I can't figure it out. Anyway, um, so I ended up raking. Oh, there we do. Turn his head, turn his head, and then he goes off. Anyway, um, so I went out and I started raking all the leaves. And I mean, I had giant, giant piles of leaves all along the front yard. And then I'm like, what am I gonna do with these leaves? So, Mike got out his blowtorch and we lit the fire, leaves on fire. And now in my mind, I'm picturing, I can take care of these leaves myself. Well, no, I couldn't. So poor Mike had to rescue me and come out and help me with the leaves because they really take off. <laughs> anyway, I need to keep up with them better. Like, 
I just didn't do what I needed to do last year and get the leaves off the yard and so we've got a lot of dead patches and stuff but anyhow so now it's all burned up I'll show you that too oh and we had a big catastrophe with the ducks as well their rubber made that they were living in sprung a crack sprung a crack sprung a leak whatever anyway all the water that they're splashing everywhere was going into the lid the rubber made lid that I had actually just set the rubber made on top of thank goodness I did that otherwise our floor would have been like ruined anyway we went to go clean the duck rubber made thing yesterday morning and there's all this water underneath on the lid bad stuff oh man it was so hard to get it out and it was spilling all over the floor and I had to mop it and Mike's like these ducks need to go <laughs> I'm like go where so we ended up putting them out in the dog facility the puppy facility in a pool a little kitty pool which one got out apparently already but anyhow my arm's getting tired so i'm gonna have to get off of here <laughs> but i'll show you guys a little of what you missed when i wasn't vlogging <laughs> well hello well hello puppies these ones here are gonna have some babies babies. Oh, you're wondering if I have the treats, aren't ya? Hi. Hi. All right, I hear the ducks. Let's go check on them. Oh my. There they are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. <laughs> oh my. Oh my, I think I'll unplug the lamp for them. This is a good little spot, just so long as they stay in. Mike said that one of them was out. So this is the area that I burned. It's all along here, the road frontage. So, looks pretty good. Now we just need to put some seed in there and, um, yeah, maybe some straw or something. All right, let's check out that playhouse. All right, there it is, guys. The playhouse. Look at it. It's looking really good. We've got a little... Cool. <laughs> Are you getting a ride? Are you making Becca your your pack horse? Yeah. Pack mule. <laughs> you guys should look them so it's looking really good. Sorry. No, don't let him go. He can go down into the creek. It's even got a little loft underneath the porch. Oh, yeah, or above the porch, I guess I should say. Okay, so coming. right up in um, there is a loft. So pretty cute. Mike found some cheap windows to put in, and he's got the giant door entry here. How fun. This is going to be a great place. Hey, Nate. Hey. How's it going? Good. Hello. Hello. <laughs> This is really tippy. Oh, oh don't no fall.
Oh man, another thing I forgot to tell you about yesterday was that I made eggplant parmesan for supper. And it was so good. Mm. Maybe I'll have it for lunch, leftovers. All right guys, cinnamon roll dough is rising and I'm getting ready to make some oatmeal raisin cookies. are coming out of the oven folks and I am whipping up another mix of puppy chow this is one box of rice checks one box of corn checks just get the cheap um, I think it's Millvale at um, Aldi or great value at Walmart still working on some cookies pan there pan in the oven cinnamon roll dough is about ready to go and this is the mix for the puppy chow. So it is, I use the um, semi-dark chocolate chips so they're not as sweet. Um, and a bunch of peanut butter and coconut oil and then you melt it all together. We're gonna pour over the checks and then you coat it with powdered sugar which is the bad part. <laughs> I just did up some more oyster crackers. These here Hannah loves, they're so good. So, mmm, yum. Just get a cheap bag of oyster crackers like at Walmart. 88 cents a bag, cheap. I like them better at Walmart because the ones at Aldi are like bigger and thicker and they're just not quite as good. <clears throat> anyway, you just put a little bit of canola oil on there, a little garlic powder, Italian seasoning, and I just tried today a little bit of Italian dressing mix. Not the whole package or anything. <clears throat> Got some Italian seasoning in the back of my throat. Anyway, this is two bags of oyster crackers. Uh, I think half a cup of canola oil and then like a whole bunch of Italian seasoning. A little bit of vegan parmesan or regular and um, I don't know. I just sprinkled a little bit of the Italian seasoning mix. Anyway, they only go in the oven for like five minutes and then you take them out, cool them out and um, they're done. So super good. I need to get going on these cinnamon rolls, and um, yeah, time's ticking. crazy ducklings got out of the pool. I was kind of worried about that, but anyway, I don't know. I put a gate thing around them. <laughs> Hoping that will help. Frosted the cinnamon rolls, cleaned up the front yard. I need a nap, you guys. But I'm gonna go check on the playhouse. <laughs> Looks like they're got the truck running. Ready to load up. All the stuff. Yep. We have the work truck on. Sure do. And we're gonna move all our trucks. Yes. And we're gonna paint it. Yay! Thank it's you. gonna be awesome. We went back to look inside. So they got it all ready for tin. They've got it all trimmed out. They've got the windows trimmed out. They've got little windows in there. Oh, look, you got the ladder. Come look at it. It's all swept out. Come on, come upstairs. Well, hop to it, kiddo. Come upstairs. Look. Yeah. Come upstairs. Okay, let's see. 
Oh, you can walk up this. It's dirty enough. I can? Oh. Why do you want me to put the camera up here? No. Do you want me to see, huh? Yeah. Guys, be careful because Daddy's shooting me also. Oh, wow, the perfect little loft. It's so cool up here. And then you've got this little board here to help prevent it's a okay. fall, There's right? There's going to be a thing up here. There's going to be a roof up here? Yeah. Yeah? So you, you, want to fall. Fall. So you won't fall out? Yeah. Or no rain. Yeah, that would be kind of bad, wouldn't it? Look at the view. Boy, if it was all skylights, right? Huh? It's going to be hot up here in summer. Hey. Honk? I'm on the letter. I mean, I'm on the ladder. Honk. Honk, honk. honk. Beep, beep. Honky. Go. Oh, guys, this is so fun. Remember, turn around when you go down. So fun. Love it. It is. It's like Noah's Ark. Yeah. Hey, guys. It's like Noah's Ark. <laughs> what is this? How long can you last? Oh my. The things these kids come up with. Mike's down there painting. Woo! <laughs> Guys. My tank top no! Your tank top blew up too. Like he's got chunky shoulders. We put a few mothballs in the woodshed to keep the snakes out. Yuck. We've never found any snakes in our woodshed. I mean in our wood pile before, but just watch. Now that we got mothballs in there, we'll probably find a snake. <laughs> Maybe they got it backwards. Maybe. Mothballs are trapped. This is the stuff that country kids find to do for fun.
special thing. Okay, just don't put it in my face. What is it? It's a beautiful, squishy, slimy piece of I don't algae. Know. It's oh, algae. Oh, it's uh, yuck, you guys. Oh, it feels so good. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. It's precious. Okay. No. It's a vegan uh, macaroni casserole for supper. Oh, everybody's hungry all the time. <laughs>